Hi everyone, I'm back again. I'm trying to share a couple of uh, dreams uh, that the Lord has given me. Now, one of them was on the 18th of February. Um, I, I don't believe I need to share the full dream, but there was one element of it that I think is important to everybody. Uh, so in this uh, segment of the dream, I was in a house with my family, including my parents, and there was a knock at the door. And I went to the door um, to um, see who was there. And when you are maybe not expecting guests, you might be a little bit cautious to opening the door because you don't know who's out there, who it is. And so I only opened the door slightly to see. And there were a few people out there and they said that they wanted to pray with me. And there was just something in my spirit. I mean, obviously, if it was a Christian brother or sister, my house is open for people to come into. But there was something in me saying not to not let them in. But at the same token, I didn't want to dismiss or... It was like I was being cautious. So I opened the door. Uh, well, I didn't actually open open. I just actually said, just hang on a minute. And um, I stepped outside and closed the door behind me. And, um, you know, so I had a willingness to pray with these people that had asked me to pray. But there was a cautiousness because I didn't know them. And um, there was something not right. Anyway, I only remember seeing two people, but in my spirit I felt like there was three. And we started to pray, and something didn't feel right. I looked at these faces, and they were distorted. They were distorting. And um, to me, the Lord was indicating to me that there was something not right about these people. It wasn't a physical deformity rather than more so a spiritual there was something not right spiritually and these people went to lay their hands on me to pray for me and when they did I felt like they were trying to use witchcraft and put a curse on me and so I began rebuking them immediately um, and so I rebuked the demons in Jesus name um, and yeah I, I felt even like I was fighting in the spirit um, I was actually doing martial arts moves, which I don't do, but it was I was I was using the Lord's words. I was rebuking them in the spirit, and they went. But it, it was like the Lord was showing me the the battle in the spiritual that was happening, um, and they went. They left. Um, so when I woke from the dream, I felt the Lord was uh, making me aware that not all was what they, not everyone who says they're Christian are what they seem and to be cautious of those that um, want to pray for you or that you let in. Um, so I know that many of us have been under attack spiritually. I know that I've had a really fierce spiritual battle recently um, and I'm just coming back out of it and, and trying to stand back up strong and tall. Um, but yeah, I just know that um, the Lord was um, making us aware that not everyone who professes to be Christian is actually walking in his power and authority. They um, um, they could be working under false doctrines. Um, basically, they have spirits in them that we're, that um, that they shouldn't have. Um, and so just to be cautious. And, I, and in my dream, the Lord was showing that I was being cautious because our body is our... Um, our temple, it's our house. When the Lord says, get your house in order, he's talking about getting your spiritual house in order. You're getting right with the Lord. And so in the dream, I didn't open the door and give full access for these people to walk in. Um, you know, my body, my temple um, is for the Lord and he resides in here. And so I could tell in my dream I was being cautious and I stepped outside to kind of you know, cautiously see what they these people were about and realize that that was the enemy trying to come in. And so I rebuked them and got rid of them before they came in. So, um, you know, there is always things happening in the spiritual. Satan will stop at nothing to trip us up. And, um, you know, we just, we need to keep that armor on, the spiritual armor, and um, and keep fighting the good fight. You know, we're almost there. The race is almost done. So um, be encouraged and uh, and just be cautious. Be cautious and, um, and pray and let the Lord guide you and lead you 
And I know that he gives us the spirit of discernment so that we are wise, wise as serpents, yet harmless as doves. Love you all. God bless.